AI power their shop has been blowing up right now. They're cute, they chat, they keep you company. But I keep thinking, what if the little bug who also helped me get stuff done? So we built a tiny robot that purchases on your screen and keeps you company whether you're cracking through work, browsing the web, or grinding out a late night game. Talk to it and it answers, ignore it and it does it off. Too warm, tell it to lower the AC a notch. Want a different vibe? Ask and it shifts the lights to game mode or any scene you set. All hands free. Switch to game mode. Game mode is now activated in the M5 stack all slab. Enjoy your gaming. It's too dark in here. The main lamp, the M5 stack on the slab is now on. Let me know if you need further assistance. Under the hood, it's surrounding the M5 stack atom as they are with an atomic apple base, which means the entire room is literally thumb size. On the software side, we forked this out to voice assistant firmware and switch the wakeboard to high end 5. Hello. It seems like there might be a bit of a mix up in your message. Could you please clarify what you'd like assistance with? I'm here to help with anything related to smart home devices or other tasks. Do you know it's my birthday today? Happy birthday! That's a wonderful day! How would you like to help me celebrate? Maybe sing me a song? Hi, N5. Hello. It's a bit late, but I'm here to help. How can I assist you? Um, is it raining today? It's currently cloudy in Shenzhen with no rain. However, during the day there might be moderate rain, and at night there will be thunderstorms. You might want to keep an umbrella handy. And we swap out the LVGL UI for the N5 GFX library. Then we layer the N5 stack editor animation library. even added a couple of new faces, like sleepy face, cool face, so the bot blinks, opens its mouth when it talks, and generally feels alive. Xiaozhi's so 1.7 update drops something called NCP endpoints. NCP stands for Model Contest Protocol, basically a way for large language models to call external tools. APIs, databases, calculations, you name it. We flip that switch, pipe the endpoint into Home Assistant with a community plugin, and suddenly every Home Assistant device was fair game. In the studio, we got the Homebox, RGB strips, smart plugs, all linked through the official Xiaomi integration. Our office ACs are already driven by a custom IO blaster built from more Atom S3Rs. And we draw a quick issue plug in on top of that. Chain those three pipelines together, and the voice command travels from the bot to home assistant and back in seconds. Making something purge on the screen is as easy as it sounds. The mount has to grip without slipping, tied a USB-C cable, and still looks adorable. After a bunch of CAD iterations and 3D prints, we landed on the final design you're looking at. And yeah, I think it's pretty cute. We even made a Lego Minifig adapter, so if you got a favorite Minifig, you can clip it on and turn the whole thing into a desktop AI bot. All the facial animations and structural design files are open source on GitHub. Links in the description if you want to build your own. If you like the video, drop a like, leave a comment, let us know what you think. This is M5 Office Lab, one little project every month. I'll catch you in the next one. Bye!